seeking to enhance existing health warnings on the use of tobacco products, traditional tobacco products such as cigarettes and tobacco nicotine products such as vapes and nicotine pouches. Speaking to the press on the sidelines of a public participation workshop in Eldoret on Monday, BAT Kenya Scientific Engagement Manager Dr. Douglas Wero raised concerns that they have what he termed a blanket approach to these proposals, saying that the current law is inadequate to support application of graphic health warnings on tobacco and nicotine products. The current Tobacco Control Act, in its, uh, it, it was formulated and enacted in 2007. Uh, is it adequate? No, it's not. Because uh, there has been a lot of changes that have happened uh, from 2007 until today. Uh, there are newer products that have come up. Uh, so the law should actually be uh, amended uh, to be able to accommodate uh, these new products categories that have come up. We are looking at information also that does not mislead. Uh, the user uh, is, not, is, is factual, yeah? uh, evidence-based. So some of the images that we are seeing, uh, and uh, we have seen the feedback that the people of Wasin Gishu are giving today, is that they are not uh, correlated at all with the products. Uh, in fact, some of them are generalistic. So basically the message that we are getting and which we agree to is that the image should correlate uh, to the risk uh, that is associated with the product. So we, we totally feel that uh, uh, the, there should be more um, uh, participation by the technical working groups to give the information that Wananchi are asking for. Give them the factual information. Tell them what is true. And uh, also as industry, we would support uh, uh, factual information being given. We comply with the law as it is. Uh, so we continually do that and we are looking forward to complying with the new laws uh, that are going to come. Now that was in Mombasa and in Eldoret, Kenya's retail industry under the umbrella of the Retail Trade Association of Kenya, RETRAC, has added its voice to the ongoing public participation on graphic health warnings for tobacco products, saying that the proposed graphic warnings for modern nicotine products are not anchored in law. Now through its chief executive, Wamboi Mbarire RETRAC says that for the draft, draft uh, graphic health warnings to be adopted for modern nicotine products such as